So how do APIs work for AI agents? So this is one of the best analogies to explain exactly how they work. And you can compare it to ordering some type of meal at a restaurant. So there's the customer, which is you. So you have the menu, which is the documentation that explains everything that the restaurant offers. You have the waiter that comes up to you, talks to you, takes your order and brings it back to the kitchen. The kitchen then retrieves the food that you want, gives it to the waiter and the waiter brings it to you. Now the whole point of the system is to extract complexity, right? The kitchen is very complex. There's lots of different ingredients, foods, meals that you can have. So it's a way to extract complexity and ensure that you get exactly what you want. Now, how does this relate to APIs? Well, this kitchen analogy is very similar to how APIs work for AI agents. So AI agents using the proper API documentation are able to retrieve data from third-party services following a similar process. These APIs act as a bridge that connects AI agents to external data and services. So first, it's really important to understand the API documentation. This is like the menu. This tells the AI agent what kind of requests it can make and what information it can expect back. So the AI agent, once equipped with that API documentation, will create an HTTP request and send it out. That request travels to an endpoint, which you can think of as the kitchen, which is basically a digital server waiting for instructions. The endpoint then processes the request, retrieves the relevant data, and sends it back as a response. And then finally, the AI agent reads that response and uses the information to perform its task. 